We all know seller support sucks. They sometimes even recommend my Amazon guy instead of helping you as a seller. Check this out. They recommended my Amazon guy. Yeah, so That's pretty cool recommendation kind of for you. Today, I am here with Carmela from our sales team. She has a very interesting story to share with us where essentially a client was coming to us directed from Amazon, I believe. <laughs> Looking into that, seeing what's going on. Carmela, thank you for joining me today. How are you? It's a pleasure, Noah. Thank you as well. I'm doing well. The interesting one and uh, kind of the topic of today, you had someone come recently and they had a little bit of a referral from someone everyone <laughs> might know. So you want to talk a little bit about that? I think that was last week. I do like my typical intro during the beginning of the meetings. I would typically ask, hey, are you familiar with my Amazon guy? Or like, how did you find us? Did you see us on YouTube or LinkedIn? And he said, no. Prior to that, have you been familiar with my Amazon guy? No, I was actually on Amazon. I was on the call with Amazon and um, mm -hmm. I have an account rep there. I'm having just some issues just because of there's like the category I'm in, there's a lot of restrictions. Mm -hmm. So it's hard to get a leg up on anybody when there's so many restrictions. Mm -hmm. And he recommended that yeah. I reach out to you guys. Basically, he was not familiar. He said that he started a brand. He's an Amazon rep. He has been working on for a lot of days, going back and forth with them with a, an issue that he has been having with his category because it was a difficult category to be in. So yeah, it's been working with his rep, with his Amazon rep for a couple of days worth of calls and they were never helpful at all. Yeah, he said that, okay, Amazon rep recommended you guys to me. Really? Amazon rep recommended my Amazon guy? And he said, yeah, it's a quite a cool recommendation for you guys. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> pretty cool recommendation kind of for you. <laughs> <laughs> then he you know, just proceeded on talking about what's really going on. And it was a typical call at the end of the day, but it was interesting to me. Outside of the norm, but Amazon at this point, knowing they can't solve their own problems. <laughs> I think everyone's had to deal the frustrations of dealing with seller support and their own reps and whatnot. So it's quite interesting to see that Amazon themselves are pretty much deciding at this point, <laughs> hey, we can't solve it. So maybe my Amazon guy can. <laughs> it's pretty hilarious, but it has been a nice conversation trying to get back and forth with that seller as well, hoping we can help. But it's really what's going on right now. I do get a lot of these calls wherein it's issue after an issue every day. People telling us they have been working a lot with Amazon, but nothing has been fixed. Can you guys help me? Because you have been recommended by a friend. I have been seeing a lot of your videos and it seems like sometimes they would also mention, I saw there was a video from Steven wherein um, Amazon told me that it's not fixable, but then there I saw a video of Steven. He said, there is a way to fix it. A lot of people are essentially coming to us when Amazon's telling them, <laughs> hey, we can't do anything for you, but uh, usually there is a solve in those scenarios. It seems it's pretty frequent. As of lately, it seems even more so seller support is just not really helping any sellers. And so they're looking for outside measures to really kind of step in and figure things out for them, which that's what we're here for, I suppose. That's what we're here for, but it's kind of ironic. I just wish that they would just fix a lot of things on their end since it's their platform anyway and it's everyone's problem right now <laughs> asking amazon to fix seller support the one oh. thing that will never happen instead they'll just direct you to outside sources to oh, you, do their you know job for them you know it best noah Absolutely. i'm sure lot, our clients are bugging you if, if ever you're getting a lot of these issues but we yeah them all the time but that's what we're here for <laughs> So no, I thought that was super interesting. I wanted to hop on. I wanted to kind of talk a little bit about that. You know, I think it's super interesting that Amazon's starting to look at outside resources and outside mm -hmm. agencies that they're not even affiliated or partnered with and yeah. whatnot. And the fact that we're able to provide that for them and they can't even solve their own problems, it makes it all the better for us. Hopefully your calendar stays full, Carmela, and <laughs> we'll see more and more people coming through from uh, some uh, referrals from Amazon themselves. It's getting interesting right now. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, thanks for hopping on with me today. I appreciate it. Yes, yeah, pleasure, Noah. Thank you as well for the time. Absolutely.